For many people, buying and selling online seems to be the new way to get rid of old unwanted items and get new ones. The City of Alabaster is hoping to start a new trend by creating safe trade zones to help protect people who use online and social media trade sites to buy and sell items. If you buy or sell things online, you can go to the zone and it is under surveillance 24 hours. Student Austin Popwell, who sold a car online, had something to say about his experience with meeting someone he did not know. It's definitely a scary thought having to go meet someone random, you know, that you've only talked to through text messaging and bringing something that they know the value of. University of Montevallo Police Chief Chad Adams has had his experience with selling online. Good. Um, I, I sold an elliptical machine. And he also has a few tips for anyone wishing to meet someone to buy or sell something. I, I think you need to be safe. I, I think that uh, we can create all kind of zones, safe zones and, and safety, safety trade zones. But I think you just got to use some common sense when you're buying and selling stuff online. Make sure that somebody is aware of what you're doing. If you were to meet someone, make sure somebody knows that you're meeting someone. Be sure to lock your door if you're sitting in your car waiting and have your money and item in hand for an even quick exchange. Reporting for Falcon Weekly, I'm Kiara Hood.